This video is sponsored by ExpressVPN. Hey, what's going on everybody? Today we are looking at breakdowns. I love them, you love them. I left the last house unlocked. We need to go back. Okay, today we're looking at breakdowns and we have 12 breakdowns here and they are Brutal. They are brutal. They are heavy. We wanted to show them to you. So, what do you think? I I think everyone's definition of heavy is going to be way different. We're going to get yelled at. <laughs> That's what I think. What's up, everybody? I want to take a moment out of this precious video to tell you about the sponsor of this video, ExpressVPN. What is a VPN, you might ask? Well, it is a virtual private network that acts as a secure tunnel between your device and the internet. ExpressVPN can also act as a proxy, meaning that you can surf the web as if you are in a completely separate location and have it appear that you're someplace that you're not being completely anonymous. I'm on the internet all the time, and as someone with a social presence, I don't have a lot of privacy, so I like to protect the privacy that I do have, and that's why I always use ExpressVPN anytime I'm surfing the internet. Especially when I'm on a public network, like a hotel or McDonald's, because these are very insecure connections. If someone's able to get a hold of your info, they basically have your internet thumbprint. They can access bank records, social security info, access your social media accounts, and a lot worse. ExpressVPN encrypts your data so you don't have to fear about someone stealing your precious data when you're on a public Wi-Fi. ExpressVPN is super simple to set up and it works on all devices. On computers, all you gotta do is open the program, select a location that you want to appear from, and connect. You're done. Now your data is safe, encrypted, and appearing to be sent from wherever in the world that you select. ExpressVPN is less than $7 a month and they know you're gonna love it so much so that they're offering a 30-day money-back guarantee. Click the link in my description to see how you can get three months of free ExpressVPN. Visit expressvpn.com slash Jared to get back your internet privacy today. This first one is called Eclipse from the band. Brand of Sacrifice. Here we go. That's sick. Great way to end that song. Right. Just noom. Yeah. This next one is called Crooked by the band. Dealer. Dealer. That's that one bangs. All right, this next one is called Necessary Death by the band. And baby. And It's so, so good. good. It's so simple and just like, why didn't I write that one? It just right? fucking smacks your right. tits. All right, the next one is the her the heretic prevails. Oh yeah, shadow of intent. This one's like this one should be iconic. This this vocal delivery is fucking so sick. Yeah, gets me, gets me honk. Is it me. one of your favorites? I, I would say vo vocally especially. Yeah, he does like six different styles in this one breakdown, and it's like super cool. Yeah. If you're a vocalist, you'll be like sick. <laughs> All right, <laughs> that was sick. Check it out. <laughs>
bras become the Majin Vegeta bra. <laughs> I, I see what I see what you mean. Yeah, it's a sexy one. That's wild. All right, this one is called Dispossession mm -hmm. by North Lane. North Lane. It's like from their first record. I uh, I don't think I've heard this one. Ooh, well, you, you, you yeah. might like this one then. This one's pretty sick. All right, <clears throat> you can hear that a lot. <laughs> But it's like it just yeah, grooves. It, gets, it yeah. just hits, hits that pocket just right. Um, this one's called "Colder Brother" mm -hmm. by the band. Very old. <laughs> You don't expect a closed hi hat it's, when a breakdown yeah. hits, but it actually like was really cool. Dude, yeah, closed hi hat is the new China for breakdowns. Yeah, uh, this one is Blasphemian. <laughs> Which one did you pick? I did both. Oh no! <laughs> so we're gonna play you two parts from Infant Annihilator's Blasphemian, and they're just amazing. <laughs> That's the first part. This that's is like, the same like in song. the middle of the song. It's yeah, like... this is the same song, by the way, and this is the second part. <laughs> Or vocals, it's both. <laughs> it's a somewhat, it's a bunch of people farting on the mic. So good, so fucking so over the top. Oh man! All right, we got a couple more, a few more here. Uh, this is called "Heavy Lies the Crown" by King Eight Ten, which is a surprising entry, but this part's just so stupid. <laughs> stupid heavy. Yeah, stupid heavy. Yes, if you will. So low. The yeah, guitars it's... are so low that it just sounds like static. <laughs> it sounds like really bass heavy static. Hey, you mind if I plug into my old colorless TV? That's <laughs> right. Alright, this next one is called Victim by the band. Vitriol. Vitriol.
That's that's like chaos heavy. That's yeah. like fucking like. That's like ah! third layer of hell. That's what metal sounds like to non-metal listeners. <laughs> yeah, that's that that. <laughs> this next one is called Black Dog by the band Shields UK. Shields UK. All right. <laughs> It literally sounds like when you just completely detune a bass and just go, <laughs> gah, put distortion on it, right. just go, gah, 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 gah. All right, we got two more. 